So what's it like being a knight in the 21st century? I dwell in the time of Nazgiel. I know not of this 21st century. You know, you don't look like a knight. Looks can be deceiving, oh silly interviewee man. Who is Nazgiel? Nazgiel is the dark overlord of the ancient times. Okay then. Well, tell me a little bit about yourself. Well, at the age of six I lanced my first boar. By eight I was wrestling giants, and now, but not last week, I was stabbed here in the abdomen by a centaur. What do you do in your spare time? Well, recently I've been training for the Duels at Dawn event. It is held annually at the Coliseum. Could you go in a little more detail about this Duels at Dawn event? Well, what I can tell you is that for the 42nd time consecutively, I will be leaving with the Golden Goblet. As a knight, do you have a trusty steed? Ah, yes. The great and noble Huffy. We have a connection, an unbreakable bond between man and beast. We even share the same sleeping quarters, something the dictator is not very fond of. The dictator? Yes. The man who rules this stoop is nothing but a tyrannical ninny. My father, also known as the dictator, he's always telling me what not to do. No pillaging, no concubines, no mutton. Uh, yes, my name's Jeffrey. I am, uh, I'm Maurice's father, or otherwise known as the Great White, of the, Great White Knight of the North, I believe. He referred to you as the dictator? Can you elaborate on that? Yeah, we, uh, we have a number of differences. Um, he's, he's difficult a lot of the time, and, you know, I, I can't have him running around with a sword as if he were, in fact, from the 1500s. And your son mentioned that he was stabbed in the abdomen recently? Yeah, um, the other day he was, uh, he was playing outside and he had a little run-in with uh, the neighbor's picket fence. Has he always been like this? Well, yes, actually. Um, he's he's um, been playing the role of a knight, I suppose, since uh, well, when he was about three, he received a uh, balloon sword from a clown at a fair. And, um, well, he, he wailed on everything he could uh, as hard as a three-year-old. Could, indeed. Is it true that he lanced his first boar at the age of six? Um, well, uh, for his sixth birthday party, I, uh, I got a, a, pi a pig piñata. And uh, he found it before, before the party and uh, tied it up himself. So what's one of the most difficult times in the household? Um, that would definitely be uh, mealtime. What is this lowly bird? This is not quail. Maurice, use your napkin. Oh, God. Use your napkin. Use your silverware. Fork, knife. Good enough, Father? Hmm? Am I using my utensils properly? Please. Just 
try and act like a civilized human being for one dinner. Civilized? There is none nobler or fairer than I in all of the land, father. If you keep eating like this, we will literally not be able to pay rent. What? The land baron has no jurisdiction here, father. I will slay him down if he tries to take our kingdom. Maurice, I am trying to have a nice, peaceful dinner with my son, Maurice, not the great white knight of the north. Oh, hello. You seem to have entered my lair at an unexpectedly early hour. It's a glorious day. It is the day of the duel. Dress me, peasant. Maurice, dress yourself. You're a grown man. Are there none that will challenge me? Are there no opponents noble enough to slay the great white knight of the north? How long do we have to wait? No one has ever come. Oh, wow. I do not believe it. Ah, a troll! I wasn't expecting a troll. Finally, a worthy adversary has a ribbon. Yeah! Ah, first blood has been drawn. Prepare for death, troll. Charge, happy. Hey, can we, uh, can we dial this down a notch? Maurice! Ah! Maurice? Have you come to taunt me again? I told you this is what happens when you play with bigger kids. He's not a kid, father. He's a local troll, and someone must stop him from pillaging the entire kingdom. Yes, you're very noble. I know, I know. Let's go. Uh, we have to stop it. Get the sword. Uh. Huffy, you lame man. You let me down. You're dead to me. Ah. Uh. So we decided that it was best that we call in a specialist um, after specialist. the Great White Knight of the North um, duel. Were you expecting the troll to come down with his club on your head like that? I don't know what you're talking about. I purposefully broke the troll's weapon against my helm, a technique I've used several times. Did you really think that would work? Listen, I'm not really comfortable with all these questions about my techniques or, or my training, okay? I am a fully qualified and noble knight whose only goal is to save the people of this fine kingdom. And if you want to point fingers and judge, maybe, maybe you should turn that camera right around, point it at yourself, interviewee man. I'm going to record that.